three reasons why homes are not selling in Chesapeake. I'm Dan Lawson with AB Homes, a rural custom home builder in Suffolk, Isle of Wight County and the surrounding areas. And today we're gonna to talk about why homes in Chesapeake are not selling. Number one, price. Chesapeake, Virginia is a beautiful area to live. We love it out there. It's a great city. However, because it's so great, there is a lot of people that want to live there. And when you have a lot of folks vying for limited resources, homes, it drives the price up. So the prices in Chesapeake are a lot higher than say for instance, rural Suffolk. On comparable homes, Suffolk versus Chesapeake, plan on paying about $30,000 more for a home in Chesapeake than you would for a similar home in Suffolk. The vast majority of Chesapeake that's been developed is going to be like cookie cutter type neighborhoods, small postage stamp sized lots. Most of the homes in Chesapeake are gonna be in subdivisions, which some people are looking for that. Cul-de-sacs, places to ride your bicycle, that's cool. Not really what we're about. There are still some rural areas in Chesapeake, but they are getting far and few between as far as finding places to build. Example, new homes in Chesapeake, new construction in the grass field, the Hickory or the Great Bridge area, plan on spending between $700,000 and $900,000. Whereas in the rural parts of Suffolk where AB Homes likes to operate, you can get one done for much less. And if you're looking for a large acreage piece of land in Chesapeake, in those same areas, probably gonna push you over a million dollars. Number two, commute. In Chesapeake, you probably are gonna be a little bit closer to shopping, dining, but you're also probably gonna spend a lot of time sitting in traffic as you try to get around. In Suffolk, not gonna run into too much traffic out this way. Something to think about, if you live in the Great Bridge area of Chesapeake, your commute time wouldn't really be much different than if you went out to the rural parts of Suffolk and built you a nice home on a large lot. Number three, I think that Suffolk's just a better option. So. If you compare Chesapeake and Suffolk together, I think that in Suffolk, you get a better bang for your buck, you get more land, less expensive, and you also kind of are getting in the ground floor where they're doing all this development out here. So, you know, think about this. If you would have bought a home and a nice chunk of land out in Chesapeake 20 years ago, think about what you would have paid for it and what it's worth now. Think of it the same way. Everything is coming this way. I believe that, I really do. You know, I think that if you're thinking about rural country living, and Chesapeake's on the table, I think Suffolk should be too. Anyways, just my thoughts on it. If you wanna learn more, feel free to reach out, 757-435-9900. Find us on the web, abhomesva.com. We would love the opportunity to talk to you about building your dreams in your next home, and we think that Suffolk's a great option. Give us a call.